Hi guys, um, this is Chrisman from FX Algo Trader. This is uh, a quick demo of the new Excel Control Suite version 2 uh, interface for MetaTrader. Um, what we're going to talk about here is the pivot systems, um, which are the most sophisticated pivot systems we've created to date. Um, this video will only just touch upon the line control aspects of the pivot systems. Um, what we see here on the screen is a euro dollar 30 minute chart. Um, you can see the Excel control suite interface on the screen um, which can be moved around and put wherever you want. Um, if we go into pivot systems you can now see um, the dashboard opens up and for the euro dollar we haven't actually got any of the pivot systems enabled at the moment. The um, version 3 um, pivot system allows a trader to set th or independently control three pivot groups, three daily pivot groups on the same chart. And the reason you may want to do this is you may want to actually have, for example, GMT calculated pivots, EST calculated pivots, and possibly some Fibonacci pivots or Camarilla pivots as well and this system allows you to layer over multiple pivot systems with different calculation bases. Um, let's have a look at just the main line control for the main pivot group. So if we enable the main pivot group, click main line control and another window comes up with all the different um, line color options, styles, widths, uh, pivot label controls, line lengths, um, and color schemes etc. Um, let's just work our way through this uh, from the top down. We've got um, four different calculation methods which this pivot system um, allows you to control. So we can have standard pivots, we can have Woody's pivots which um, put more weight on the central pivot um, of the day, um, Fibonacci based pivots and obviously Camarilla based pivots as well for people that like trading using the Camarilla systems. Um, for this example we'll just use a standard calculation basis. Um, our line colors here, we can set line colors for all the pivot levels independently um, and we also have templates um, down at the bottom left hand corner here which allow traders to specify schemes which they may like. So for example um, we can ch very quickly change the pivot scheme from you know to scheme two which is a uh, effectively all blues with a central pivot in Alice blue um, we can then change our templates if we want to we've got three templates and by clicking on templates we can now see here edit scheme one or two or three and if we want to edit scheme one we can simply go into it and we may want to have a dashed central pivot line um, and we may want to have a slightly bigger um, pivot label text as well. So we can simply very quickly do those changes. Um, so we have a complete array of, of controls over colors, styles, um, line widths. We can also change the fonts for the pivot labels, the weight, whether they're bold in italic or, or just standard, um, the size of the pivot labels. We can also add text to the, the pivot label as well to differentiate it from other pivot systems which we may be running. So in this example I've just got main in brackets or M in brackets. I can also nudge the labels as well, um, i.e. move them left or right so that you can basically create clear labeling systems when you've got multiple labels displayed, i.e. you can stagger the labels so they're all visible at the same time. Um, with regard to the, the way that the lines are controlled, we can draw the lines as rays, i.e. lines extending into the future, or we can um, extend the lines out for, till midday the following day, and we can trim the line by, um, in a, by X number of hours here, very simply. We can also obviously hide our M levels if we wish as well. So let's just show you this in action, just show you a few, a few bits and pieces here. We'll, we'll display the lines as an array, we'll hide the M levels and we'll just close that interface and now the, set the settings will be applied to the euro dollar chart and on the next tick on the screen there you see the pivots have now been applied using the color schemes which we defined the other thing um, 
which is worthy of note is the top left hand corner of the chart you can see a main pivot data window being displayed with uh, the calculation data in here so as it's Monday today the system has calculated the pivot data from 8 o'clock on Friday um, sorry 8 o'clock on Thursday through to 2100 hours on Friday which is the, the close of trading um, we can change all this this calculation basis however we want to um, very simply by going into the uh, pivot calculation control module here and if we want to actually change the start calculation times and the end calculation times we can just simply adjust those by X number of hours by retarding the system or advancing the system by using either negative or positive numbers um, so you can tune your pivot system exactly how you want it to work so wherever you are in the world whichever uh, time zone you like to trade in whether that's EST or GMT or the Asian um, market opening times you can tune it accordingly um, I'll, I'll, I think it's probably better to do another video explaining how the pivot control works um, so I'll come on to that next um, I hope this just gives you an indication of how quickly you can control or ch make changes to the pivot system uh, if anyone has any questions please don't hesitate to get in contact info at fxalgotrader.com thank you very much for listening